What is up guys and welcome back to another video Now today we're going to be reviewing some brand new ragdolls that are put on the workshop Now they, I don't know if 100%, I'm not 100% sure But I do believe they are part of the TGFB pack I believe they're an update to it I'm not 100% sure on that, do not hold me on that But I think they are I don't know, I just kind of find out, found out about them On the Gmod workshop So we're going to check them out now so here are the Punk Rocks, obviously they're edits to the Glam Rocks, and they are very, very cool. They actually have been on the uh, SFM Workshop for a little while now, I believe almost two months. I have actually animated them in a little short animation I made. So obviously, these ragdolls will be linked in the description down below, obviously, but they are pretty cool, I will say. So they do, I believe all of them have body groups, yes, so I guess we'll start off with Punk Rock Freddy. So for Punk Rock Freddy, you can make his eyes glow, you can, uh, okay, that's the scanning thing, so, you know, whenever he scans Gregory, see who he is, and, uh, then we got hacked, so obviously when William Appleton has hacked him, and then, uh, so, yeah, right, take away the glasses, you know, because, you know, glasses are for nerds, that's what I always say, I'm just kidding. Um, so, let's see, torso bands, oh, those things, okay. Alright, so you can get rid of those, I guess, and take away his jacket, because, you know, who needs a jacket? Like, you know, j jackets aren't cool, you know? Yeah, y y you're a loser, Glenmark Freddy. <laughs> I mean, he always was, let's be real. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not gonna get into that, but I do. Uh, but the, my, my hatred for Glenmark Freddy is just personal, okay? It's very personal, alright? I genuinely, actually, I, like, I, Glenmark Freddy is probably my least favorite FNAF character ever. Anyways, so, um, and I have my reasons why. Not because of the games but my reasons. Anyways, so he has these uh, glasses, like I'm pretty sure I mentioned them uh, in the body groups, but you can move them around if you so please. So they do have physics, you know, uh, you can just make them go inside his face because you know, he, who, who doesn't want to do that, you know? But yeah, so he's got some uh, cool shades, you know? Uh, I'm not complimenting him, I'm complimenting the shades. He's still not cool, but the shades are, all right? Anyways, also he has like the little design on the uh, back of the jacket with the uh, Secure Breach logo. Uh, do th don't they all have that? Oh wait, oh no. Oh, they all have specific ones. Wait, hold up. That's cool. Okay, I, I thought they all had the same one. No, they all have each individual ones. Okay, that's actually cool. How did I not notice that? I don't know. But yeah, so obviously, you're a physics. We, we all assume that by now. Um... But I think my only like critique about these types of models is the fact that their fingers are imposed. I mean, I guess it's just the fact that I've just kind of gotten accustomed to having uh, ragdolls with automatically posed fingers. So just seeing them not posed anymore just kind of feels weird to me now, I guess. But that's really my only critique specific, I guess, because I'm not I'm not no like add on critic. I, I don't like I'm not. I don't really go that much detail into design wise I just go over the overall basis of what I see if I if I genuinely see a problem with physics I'll probably bring it up honestly I now I'm thinking about it I don't know should the glasses be bouncing sideways I don't know if they should be doing that I feel like they should be only going up and down but I don't know maybe that's a flaw or something in them I, I don't know but anyway so that's that's Freddy Next, we got Punk Rock Chica. So, Punk Rock Chica, let's uh, let's at least take a look at the body groups and stuff. So, alright, hold up, let's see if, so there's the leg warmers, so the things down here in the lower legs, so you can hear, I get, I, honestly, I don't, I don't know what I thought those were the entire time, um, with the glam rocks, like Roxanne, you know how she has like the purple bit, the, like the, her lower legs are like purple, and like the purple and black pattern I, i'm forgetting exactly what it looks like but it's mostly purple i don't know if those are actually leg warmers or if that's just what we're calling them for these guys i don't know but i don't know i thought i just thought that was just part of the design pattern of the actual animatronic i didn't think they were just accessories on the animatronic i don't know why but i don't know anyways so i guess you can get rid of those if you want which is looks weird especially since the fishnet thing doesn't go down the entire leg, so it's just kind of weird, I guess. Um, anyways, so speaking of the fishnet, I believe he could just, can't you, wait, fishnet, socks, wait, socks, I'm sorry, what? Wait, what does that do? Oh, so it gives, like, oh, like, the, 
I, I'm assuming that means like socks to go up in the entire leg or something. I don't, I don't know what that. <laughs> it just says socks. So I'm just gonna go with that. And also, you could just, uh, take away both if you want. I guess I don't know. Um, and let's see here. Belt. Wait, there's a belt. Oh, that thing. Okay. I, was so, <laughs> I don't know what I thought that was. It was just there. I guess I just wasn't really paying attention to it. So I'm like, oh, okay. Uh, to take take away the jacket, I guess. But, um, we don't really need to do that, so... Scary, yes, that's an option. But, yeah, alright, so... That's Punk Rock Chica for ya. And then there's Punk Rock Freddy. So then we got Punk Rock Monty. Um, so let's see here, Punk Rock Monty. So, his glasses also have physics, so that's also pretty dang snazzy. Now, I can make compliments about Monty, because he's not... He's not a piece of filth like Landmark Freddy. Yeah, I'm talking about you, what are you gonna do about it? Uh, okay, not 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 the edit of him. The edit of him is cool. All right, the the edit of him is very cool. I love the punk rocks, but just Glamrock Freddy in general. I'm I'm sorry. I have a I have a burning hatred for him, and I shall not explain why. I I, sh I, I shall not. Anyways, back to Monty. So let's see here. So you can take away his glasses if you so please. I guess uh, you can also take away his jacket, which honestly I'm not gonna lie. He doesn't look too much different. I mean, maybe that's just me. Okay, yeah, that's, that's actually just me. Maybe, I don't know. Yeah, I think that's really it for Monty's, like, body groups and whatnot. I'll probably come back to them with design. I mean, like, obviously they have the jacket with their logos. They got, you know, he's obviously got his tail. Like, there's not much additional stuff I can add, you know, besides just some cool stuff that was added onto it, which I think is really cool. But, you know, I don't want to spend too long talking about individual stuff. Like, you see, uh, you see what's on him, I don't have to describe it to ya. If you, if you think it's cool, you can go get them in the description. Boom, there you go. But yeah, um, anyways, next up we got... Punk Rock Roxy. So... Let's see here, okay, so, wait, skit, wait, d did they have skit? Wait. She's the only one that has skit- wait, I'm so confused- Oh, right. I forgot about this, because again, they were in SFM, and I believe this is a thing you could do in SFM. If I'm correct, I also might be wrong, I don't know. But anyway, so we have the red jacket, black jacket, you can also make the uh, main clothing, like the uh, shirt and uh, pants or shorts or whatever, whatnot, you know what I mean? You can make that red if you so please, or you can make them both red, which honestly looks just weird, in my opinion. I think it looks best just naturally like that anyways so i mean if you so please you can also have it like that but i honestly prefer it with the red jacket but yeah all right so it's your jacket so if i bleed if i recall this messes with the sleeves so we got medium sleeve long sleeve also okay hold up is there are what the arm warmers yeah get those out of the way so that way i'm able to actually see the sleeves and you know get get rid of the jacket if you want um where the heck did the jacket go okay there it is and yeah, honestly, I think it's just fine the way it is. Like, I mean, yeah, I, I see no point in just having it the other way. I think it's fine the way it is. Anyways, have that back. Um, I don't think I even did this. Uh, you can take away the glasses if you want. Honestly, I think it looks better with the glasses. Wait, do the glasses have a 6 too? Aw, oh, dang, I don't think they do. Aw, oh, man, now I'm sad. <laughs> the glasses don't have a 6 <laughs> I'm just kidding, it it's doesn't really matter that much. Um, also, uh, the front hair has physics, which I think is really, really cool. Because, um, wait, does, does it Glimmer Chica's hair have physics? I swear to God it does, hold up. Yep, it does. But yeah, so, obviously, uh, well, I mean, obviously, we kind of expected at this point for Roxanne's hair to have physics, but it actually does have better physics than uh, Ultimate FNAF Pack 1, I will say that. One thing I will hold the these models above Ultimate FNAF Pack. What one thing I can definitely no doubt about it hold above is the fact that the tail doesn't weigh the pelvis down. That that's amazing. That's amazing because Ultimate FNAF Pack, if you don't know, remember that Roxanne, her pelvis is weighed down by the tail. But yeah, so it, it's nice to see that you know someone actually bothered to try to make it not do that. You know. But anyways, uh, 
One thing I am noticing though is how these shorts are like constantly kind of clipping into the uh, legs if whenever you like move the ragdoll around a little bit. I don't know if that's able to be fixed or something or I don't know. Creators, if you if you feel like fixing that, uh, you know that'd be snazzy, but you don't have to. Uh, it's not like a general complaint that I feel like is like fully necessary to be changed, but it's just a little critique I just threw in there. But anyway, so you can get rid of the necklace thing, which uh, I believe that, yeah, that says one on it, because you know number one, because obviously Roxanne's number one, obviously. Anyways, so, um, yeah, arm warmers, uh, yeah, yeah, again, you can take away those. Uh, the fishnet thing on the uh, torso, you can take that away if you so please. Uh, pants, so you can give her normal shorts, or you can give her pants, if you so please. And, uh, yeah, so you can do that, um... You can also, wait, hold up, I'm trying to read all this, so, I'm just gonna click on them, see what they do, because I don't know, honestly, it's been, a, I honestly forgot where all the body groups were, so let's see here, uh, don't really know what, hold up, what did that even change, uh, oh, got rid of those things, okay, um, let me see, socks, uh, where are their socks, I'm sorry, what, hold up, what, wh where, oh, I didn't even click on it, okay, so it's like, with, uh, Punk Rock Chica, you can add those, Anyways, so then, uh, socks, no extra. Okay, so there's those things. It just gets rid of those things with the sock. None. So you just take all that away. And then there's, uh, alt legs. Was that? Oh! It's like, uh, yeah, this is what I was talking about. Hold up, let me get rid of these. This, this is what I was talking about with, uh, normal Roxanne. Like, uh, it's like this, except it's purple. Remember? That, that, this is what I was thinking of, like, yeah, this is how Roxanne normally looks. Alright, but, um, yeah, and then none long- ah! <laughs> So, you could just send her legs into the abyss. <laughs> and her feet are still here, that's great. The fact that her feet are still here. So she just has no legs, but she still has her feet. Oh my god, that's amazing. <laughs> Alright, anyways, so, um... I don't know, I just thought that was funny. Anyways, so that's about it for, uh, Punk Rock Roxy. Uh, yeah. So, anyways, moving on, we are going to move on to the, uh, rooms in here. The party rooms, or what whatnot. So we have three models in here. So we have... Correct me if I'm wrong, but obviously the, I know this is a little bit in this tangle, but if I'm correct, your name is Vicky. I'm pretty sure I'm correct. I swear to God, if I got that wrong, I will actually feel sad, but I'm almost positive that's her name. I swear to God it is. But anyways, so, I mean, obviously this is like a uh, Mangle, Fix, Mangle, Fontai Foxy, whatever, uh, style for the, uh, Glenmark, but, you know, their, their, actual, their model's name is Vicky. Oh, yeah, they got the speaker, so, wait, they all do, wait, what? Ah! <laughs> wait, okay, I mean, it makes sense for, like, Lulbit and whatnot, I'm assuming, like, you know, this is Funtai Foxy style, so it probably would have that, but, why Tangle? If I'm correct, Tangle isn't, I mean, like, I, maybe it's supposed to be following the style here, I don't, I don't know, because... Tangle's not a version of Funtime Foxy. So, what's up with the speaker? I'm... I don't know. Anyways, uh... We'll, we'll, we'll get to Tangle in a minute, because Tangle's obviously probably, like, one of the coolest models I think I've seen. It may, obviously, one specific feature. We all know what that is. But, um, uh, well, let's go over the others real quick. So I guess we'll go over Vicky real quick. So, um, wait, did her legs just clip through the table? I swear to God they did there, but you know what, maybe that's just me, I don't know, I'm probably going insane again. Um, oh, okay, okay, this, I like this, the little, uh, pink tip to the tail, that's kind of cool. But anyways, so, let's check out body group. So, you can get rid of the bow tie and the speaker, okay, so you can do that, you can do that, but that is all for body group, so I guess we'll just look at the actual design itself. So, the hair is actually a lot shorter than, a uh, rock. Roxanne's normal hair length because if I'm correct because I don't think punk rock Roxy's hair is really shortened at all I think it's about the same length as Roxanne's normal hair So yeah, like her hair is 
uh, pretty shortened compared to like, you know, normal uh, Roxanne type hair. So, like, you know, the average uh, hair length of the uh, Roxanne models. Anyways, so, obviously, like rock, Punk Rock Roxy, I believe the front hair has some physics. Not as much as the Roxy. I think it just has slight physics, but yeah. Anyway, so then it's got the hook, you know, you know, because, you know, if you want to, uh, not, 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 you know, stab anybody, you know, now, yeah, we're not gonna do that, so, um, you know, just has a hook, because, you know, hook, I don't know. <laughs> so, yeah, it's got a hook, um, let's see here, so, I already said something about the tail, I'm trying to, I'm trying to think, my brain just dying today, um, it has got like a star pattern across her legs, which is kind of cool. Alright, it's got a lot of different patterns. Also got like a star pattern across her face. I'm surprised I just now actually paid the thought of that. And yeah, she also has like a, a red star on her chest, so that's kind of cool. Anyway, so now we're going to move on to a little bit. Now, I will say, uh, Tangle has, uh, is probably cooler in terms of like, well, I mean, obviously that feature just no doubt about it just makes the model probably cooler but i feel like lolbit has the most unique like coloring scheme is that me is that just me i feel like lolbit has more of a uh, more unique type scheme to her i don't know in terms of like uh the colors and um just design wise with like all the different colors and patterns i think lolbit's cooler in that category but yeah, maybe it's the hair, I don't know. I don't know what it is, but Lulbit's just cooler. I, I don't know why. But anyways, so, obviously, Hook. And, uh, you got uh, the white glowing eyes, you know, like Lulbit normally has. And instead of pink, I don't think I mentioned that. Oh, wait, oh, it's like pink on front, red on back. I actually did not notice that. But, um, so for Lulbit, it's uh, purple on the front and orange on the back. You know matching her color schemes you know purple and orange but yeah so she has a uh, pink I believe that's supposed to be a heart like a sideways heart or something on her face because uh, yeah because Tangle has a flower scheme to her uh, Vicky has a uh, star scheme to her and a little bit has a heart scheme to her so yeah I'm assuming that's like a sideways heart or something but anyways so she has an orange tip on her tail, so that's kind of cool. And, um, yeah, a lot of pink hearts, and that's about all I really have to say for a little bit. I can check out body groups, though. Yeah, okay, it's the same thing. Bowtie speaker. Anyways, now we got Tangle. One of the coolest models. Just because, like, okay, come on. How can you not say that's cool? Like, the fact that the, I, I don't know, like, cause I'm not, I'm no expert in modeling or anything like that, I, I don't even have almost any knowledge in it that much, but, I don't, but, I don't know if this is supposed to be an easy thing to do, but from, I'm just gonna guess that it isn't, so, we gotta at least give them some credit here, like, that's actually really cool, to have, like, a, uh, constant changing pattern, and you could change the different type of static you want it. So like, ah, okay, so there's two different versions, so you you can have it stay as one, but you can also have it animated, which I think is really, really cool. You can also take away the Bowtie Speaker as usual, but, um, ooh, skins. Oh, okay, you can make her, uh, um, pattern light up a little bit. Oh, okay, and you can't do that with the others. That's actually cool. Wait, does it glow in the dark? Does it glow in the dark? We must know. Does it... Holy frick, it glows in the dark. Wait, do all of them do that or no? No, I, I need to know now. I'm sorry, I actually need to know. Okay, no, they don't. Dang it, ha. Uh, whole bit. You're really losing points here, come on. I'm rooting, for, I was rooting for you. Anyways, um, yeah, so, okay, so you can make them glow in the dark. That is genuinely cool, I really like that. Alright, but anyways, so... That's really all I have to say for all these models. Obviously, there's a lot of other stuff I could be talking about, like, you know, the color schemes, the patterns. But, you can see it. Like, there, like when it comes down to review videos, there's not a lot for you to really talk about. Because, I mean, they can see everything that's up with the model themselves. You don't really need to explain it to the audience. 
But um, one thing I also, but I will say though, is that she has this like thing with her arm. I don't know how to explain it, but it looks cool. Anyways, so that's all I really have to say for these three. Anyways, so yeah, so that's really all I have to say. Link to the description down below. So if you want to check it out, go ahead. And uh, yeah, so that is about all I have to say. And I will see you all in the next one. Bye-bye.